I'm off to work, but I'm late and I uh, just a minute. So today we are celebrating International Volunteer Day. I'm late. I need to get early. So as you can see, I have the cake with me for the day. I'll be delivering it. As you'll see how my day will be going. I couldn't show you my outfit, but if I get time, I'll show you what I'm dressed for today. Uh, maybe it's not clear, but let's get this done. I've not even done anything. I'm all late. I'm all late. I've not, I'm not, I don't know if I've carried everything or I've forgotten something in the house, but hope not. So I have to rush and be there on time. I'm not that late, but if I'm not careful, I'll be late. Welcome to my YouTube channel. So guys, we're having a celebration today, International Volunteer Day, and that's why I'm in routine. So as a volunteer, this is our day to celebrate every year, 5th of December. So tag along and see how my day will be. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. So I'll be picking my son. I didn't come with him. So later on, yeah. So here he goes. Now we're going to the coffee and then we're yes, going with him for the celebration. We're going to we're eat together yes, and eat dinner. I don't like me uh, staying far from him if i have the ability so today i'll be working with the volunteers my fellow volunteers we'll be having our celebration at hyrax hill yes so that's where we are enrooting we are using a school bus mamangina school bus so this is where we are fitting and uh yes all thanks to mamangina for coming along so it's just the school next to us and uh, as we always say it's always good to love your neighbors it's always good to have that good relationship with your neighbors so we have one with them so before we en route everything was packed on the bus and we are having a briefing session with the in charge uh, so we're being told on how the day will unfold yes as you can see my son is all set so i'm not the one who always sits beside him when i get to work so yeah, he's friendly too. So as you see, the school is next to where our branch is located. Mamanginan School around Ronangala Street. That's where we are located. So if you want to volunteer with us, feel free. You can join us. Kenya Red Cross Nakuru County Branch. See how beautiful it's branded. It looks amazing. So this is where I spend my time as a volunteer of kenya red cross nakuru county so it doesn't take anything uh it's just the best that you can give being in a humanitarian organization so anyway let's get in route let's get let's get this done let's get to our destination where is where our event will take place so tag along For my Nakuru people, this is the way leading to Hyrax Hill. Uh, we use a diversion there onto the footpath and we got here. So, 
I wasn't able to take a clear video. There are a lot of things that are in front, but yes. Kohaira, yeah, yeah. yeah. So I'll be going direct to the kitchen. I'll be cooking today. That's my area. Though I'll join in for fun. So yes, yeah, so I've had that. That's the far end, as you can see, where my lady is going. No, that, yeah, the straight. That's where we're going to uh, uh, put our tent for cooking. So you'll spend a day here, we cook, we have mbuzi, we have to make some breakfast. It's already 12, the schedule is way behind. It was supposed to start at 9, but it has not yet started. So we'll go along with this. So, yeah. Nyama yetu ndio hii hapa nyuma. Ndio hii nyama. Tuko na keki hapa, masufuria ziko hapo mbele. So yes, so it's a feast day. Come and feast with us. See the advantages of being a volunteer. Na Kuru County branch you are being spoiled today. So join us as we celebrate. So this is our kitchen. Let me show you. This will be our kitchen for the day with the ladies. We are boozing here. <laughs> so these are the some of the things that I'll be having in the kitchen, uh, the meals uh, to prepare, the items to use in the kitchen, things to serve. So yes, so, uh, first of all I need to dress up for the kitchen as always you wrap up your head and you put on working attire which is just an apple if you have anything else. So let's get this done as the um wakini saidia kuwasha meko. I prepare myself then we start uh, the menu for the first menu is supposed to be coffee and mandazi so i'll be doing it real quick because there's no time so yes tag along <laughs> was a quick one so yes I uh, had a lot to do arrangement before you settle down for mandazi you know when you start making mandazi you don't move all around so uh, <coughs> it's time for mandazi and um, we're going to uh, mix all the ingredients make our dough and cook our mandazi so let's get this done <laughs> is uh, running well in the kitchen setup as you can see this is more of even a camp setup you can get something like this it's always no big space but uh, whatever area is convenient so this is how the meats are going this one is for choma as you can see so they are preparing it so we have had people who are preparing meat for choma I was doing the cooking on the other side uh, I don't know even how to do nyama choma so as you can see it's always good to taste if the fire is okay so let's get all these done. <laughs> I'm 
I'm telling you, if you want catering services, Katie Apple, she's the clerk. Mm. Mm. Yeah, lad. Mm. Yeah, who you up at? Not the OPR here. Hey, she's a good recording artist today. Hey, is it, is it, this is videography, photography. All of these equipment are hard. Hey, hey, thank you. What up, when you see me back to the day duty. Yes, which I'm in the kitchen, so we're almost done with the meat. So I'll be taking the meat back to the fire, yes, so that it can cook. Well, Kwame Koyetu, so let's continue with the work. Yes, today is all about me in the kitchen cooking. What happens in the kitchen today with me? So this is the vlog that you're doing today. Hope this fire you're really enjoying it to spend the day with me uh, this is my hustle you can support me if you're having an event you need someone to do catering services for you house calls i do them furthermore i come a full package you don't need to order a cake i do it so i did put rice first i started by cooking rice after the mandazis were done and yes we have our firewood here we have everyone helping set aside this team is so amazing I had less firewood and they came through for me. So I'm so humbled, very humbled. Uh, we forgot the jikos because I can say we had a lot like we were in a hurry while we'll it and all that. But this is enough. So this is what happens. You can never miss this moment. So I'm taking you along with me. I never listen to the words you say. Oh no, I never look in your eyes of sorrow. I never listen to your cries of so this is Ugali. Let me just video credit my son. He's the one who's capturing this moment. And uh, yes, I'm training him a little bit so that when it's me and him, he can help me. So anyway, back to the agenda. So how many people? You can cook Ugali for how many people? Yes, we're having an event that's almost to 80 people. And yes, I'm cooking the Ugali because I'm the one in the kitchen. So we're doing it this way. They say you go hard and yes and smart so we we on to eat so it's always good when you feel supported and you have a field to nurture what you can do I've just added the soup that I boiled with the meat so that I kept aside. Yes, so right now I'm just time is off and we need to get this done. I'll be making some saute still on this other fire as I cook still on the other side, then we get done. cooking everything only the potatoes were left so uh we, we still have some intestines matumbo for my side me i'm done cooking so they'll be boiling from here as i told you the nyamachama and matumbo the, the um other side of the meat besides you there are people who are helping and i was doing my side too so i can call it a wrap for cooking just because we still have another phrase of serving so let's get the serving side so it's time to set up for the food so the ugali i'll be cutting it and putting it in the shipping uh, so that it can be served from there so we have another thing that is rice that we'll be eating too so let's get this done one two three four So 
that's the fun I missed. But yes, I had to work hard and smart. So we finishing, but not finishing per se. But people are serving. Then they'll be cake cutting. As we call it a wrap, then we go back to our destinations, which are home. Those who are going back at the branch, they go branch. So thank you so much for the support you've given me. Thank you so much for watching from the beginning till now. I'm so humbled. I'm so humbled. I'm so humbled. Maso Fanis is a chef de la chef royal cake. If you have any orders, give us what cakes.